Most people call me Terry. You can call me Big T. My son Tanner over there, he's Little T. Some people call me Tito. Some people call me MT. It's like TMT, like a TNT. Dynamite sticks go boom, boom, boom. And I'm all about the action and I'm making an impact. And in this here family, at the Mims family, we're all about making impacts on the ball field, on the grill. Grill masters, that's the way it rolls. I'm the head of the Women's Auxiliary and the PTA at, uh, at Bartlett Elementary and Junior High School. And I kind of, I keep the ball rolling with this family. Like, people like to get off track, especially, especially Terry. He, he gets off in his own sports world, and I don't really know where to stop him. But... I keep him in check. I also run the baked goods sales down at the uh, First Methodist Church every other Wednesday. I like to help people, and I love I love people, but I, I love my family first. If that makes any sense, I don't really, I don't really know how to speak sometimes. But family first—that's that's my my motto. Something I like to live by. Mama. What, Tanner? Oh, hey, uh, I'm Tanner, or his dad likes to call me Lil T. But, uh, I, anyway, I like to play baseball. So, my dad really tries to push me to be the best I can be. And, uh, this season upcoming is, is a big one because he wants me to make varsity next year, so. Looks like I have a good shot. My name is Candy Mim, K-A-N-D-I. And uh, my friends, they tell me that I am a uh, sweet woman. I like to think of myself as a kind of rough and tough tumbler, but my friends think I'm sweet, and I tell them, with a name like Candy, I'd better be. <laughs> anyway, uh, you know, the family's really into sports. I'm not really into sports, and uh, I'm more on the fashion side, as you can see here. Uh, necklaces and uh, latest fashions and designs. Is that, is that a Louis Vuitton shirt? This is, um, no, I got this one at Penny's or something. JC uh, Penny's. But, anyways, uh, but. You know, the family, we all get along real well, but when Rick and Terry get together, it's, it's real trouble. Well, first off, she's full of shit. My name's Rick Mims. I'm a part owner of Mims Boat and Supply. Not to be confused with the construction project that Terry's working on. We're two completely different breeds, me and him. I like to think of myself as kind of cool, calm, you know, collected most of the time. He's pretty hard on that boy, his. And I don't really like it that much, but it ain't my kid. I personally hate those little shits, to be quite honest. But I love, I love baseball. That's, I like to say my, my first love is baseball. And my second love is candy. You know, I, you know, the the first song that we danced to actually at our wedding was "I Want Candy." It was, but well, we kind of slowed it down a little bit. You know, people they seem to like that. But From the rockets, red glare, the bombs burst in in there. Our flag was still there. Oh, St. Us and Star Spangled Banner, yet wait for the land of the free and the Bye.
Tanner, I told you to quit messing around and get on inside and get ready. Now, little T, do it. I'm not going to sit here and say it again. Please, now. All right, I'm going. I'm not going to bed. Going. That's what I thought. Now, go on. For me a damn beer. Yeah, so I looked over and the, the boy had slid head first on into home and he got up and, had, and actually, you know, everybody thought he had dirt all over his backside. Well, it turns out he had shit himself. <laughs> and I looked over, I looked over at Tanya, I said, God almighty, that boy shit himself. I mean, what do you think of that? I mean, that's got to be embarrassing. Like, you running, you're celebrating because you slid home. But you have poop all on your backside. You know, walking to, getting your mom to walk you to the, the bathroom to clean yourself up like a little billy baby. That's kind of. It wasn't a pretty sight. It was not a pretty sight. I'll tell you what. We need to get ready though. Go in there and, and grab Tanner. And uh, I need you to probably shag balls out there. Find your mitt. Man, I'm always shagging balls, Terry. Well. That's I the shag price. your balls all the time. Rick, I've always that's the price you gotta pay for excellence to be a men. So now go get your mitt. Alright. Come on now. Play ball. <laughs> Little T, put put that in the back of the truck. You stupid. Get back seat. Back right. seat. God damn. Bats and balls are good. This here is my pride and joy, my construction truck, my uh, love away from Tanya. It is, uh, my company is Hump Hill Construction. Uh, we're a good company. Now, uh, I have always said, you know, a man without a car is no man at all. But you give a man a truck, that's like giving her an extra set of balls. Let's load them up, boys. Hit some baseball. Out there? You know what's the difference between them and you? They're out in the field right now here in the dugout. Let's get you out in the field. Come on. Grab your stuff. In order for Tanner to make the all-star team, we got to go over fundamentals first. <laughs> There's lots of guys that go out there and they think they're just going to be able to slug the ball. No, that's wrong. It's all about fundamentals. Tanner, get over here. What we going to do, you going to put your bat down like that. Come over here. Come over here like that. Okay. 
and you go look at everybody. You might even you might tip your cap to the crowd real quick before you walk up there. Just you, you, you a lot of baseball, you know, it's about being a it's a bit of a showmanship type thing. So it's not just hell. You can go. I've struck out um, more than I hit the ball, but it, I was a showman, you know. So I went out there and the tip of the hat. Everybody loved me. Everybody loved me. I did. Sometimes I'd clap for them or throw out a couple, throw some gum into the dugout. All my teammates would cheer for me and everything. So you can do that first, okay? You, you got that out of the way. You're kind of a superstar. And then you go up here. Let's do. And we're gonna get a little dirt on our hands. We want to feel like we've already started playing the game. Does that make sense, Steve? Yes, sir. Okay. Now we're gonna grab our bat. We're gonna spit in our hands. We're going to get a good, good, lather it up, spin our hands a little bit, spit like a real man. There we go. This is how I made varsity. If I had known this, I probably would have led the league in homers before that, but you know, I didn't know it until before varsity tryouts. I, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't matter, you know. I'm just saying I probably would have, you know, been the best hitter in the league, but I, I learned it later, so that got me on the team. But anyway, we're going to squash the bug, okay? Now, I, I, a lot of us, you know, uh, I know you don't like bugs. I don't like bugs. Summertime, we got mosquitoes everywhere, all over us. So what we're going to do is, we'll get down here on the plate. We're going to mark our spot, our territory. It's like uh, I'm the lion, and this is my kingdom, and I'm going to mark my territory. I'm not going to shit on it like an animal would, but I'm basically and metaphorically going to shit right here on this plate, and this is my territory. And the umpire and the other team and all my players and everybody in the stands knows it. So I'm going to get right here, mark my spot, shit in my area, get my bat ready. We're already warmed up. Dig down, feet planted perfectly, and I'm just going to squash. Squash. And you want to kill him. You want to step on his head, grab his neck, and full throttle kill the bug. Squash. Squash the bug. Squash the bug. And then you want to follow through. Follow through. Squash and follow through. Squash and follow through. The ball will sail over the fence. You will be the hometown hero, the legend for as long as you live. So let's see you do it. Full speed ahead, come on. Here we go. All right, step one. Step one, what do we do? Come on, come on, step one, what do we do? There we go, say it out loud. X mark the spot. Okay, good, X mark the spot. What do we do next? Make sure you make it right. Right? Yeah, okay. Step three. Shoulder square. That's all right. Shoulder square. Okay. Now, let's rock, rock and fire right here. Let's go. Boom. I didn't hear. What would you do? What would you do to the... I think that bug's still alive. Look at him. Look at him. He's still crawling around right here. He's still alive. What are you going to do to him? You want, you, don't want, you, want to never, you want that bug to be devastated. You want to squash him so bad that your hips turn like this, like that, and that ball is flying into orbit, okay? Come on, here you go. No pressure. I'm sorry, I need all real aggressive. It's all about all-stars. Here we go. Ooh, yeah. That looked good. Now run the bases. Run the bases. Dig, dig. Fly, head first. Head first in the hole. No, fuck, come on. He threw the pass ball. What you gonna do? Read and react. Read and react. He's safe. He's safe. Good, good job, buddy. Come on, come on. We're gonna get you in the field here in a bit.
Watch out!